And I thought, well, maybe this is this is the right thing to do. This is the right way. You know, look at all the love they show me. At 14 years old, Chad Williams didn't think there was any other way to live your life. He wanted to put a gun in my hand and wanted me to go do, you know, do things or, or sell drugs or do stuff to make money. Williams was a gang member for 13 years. He's been in and out of prison, shot, stabbed, and seen things he can't even talk about. But it was one night sitting in a cold jail cell, he decided to turn his life around. My heart that was once black, you know, finally opened up into a, a normal person's heart. You know, I had feelings for people. I felt I felt pain for other people and uh, sorrow for other people when back then, years ago, I didn't. I had I was heartless. Tired of being in jail and tired of hurting his family, Williams decided to work with the Full Circle Refuge and tells teens his life story so they don't walk down the same path he did. I have the tattoos, you know, everything that will draw a kid's attention that's into that lifestyle or wants to be a part of that lifestyle. I'm here to, to mentor them, to show them that that path ain't the way. Richmond County deputies say teen crime goes up during the summer months and typically teens get in trouble for petty crimes. But William says it's those small infractions that lead them to committing major crimes. And he says it's during the summer that teens need their parents the most. We'll say things to our kids sometimes and it goes in one ear and out the other. But sometimes somebody else who actually have been there and done that and have experienced the, uh, I guess, the woes of that, that type of life, um, it it, it can be an eye opener to them. So it's a way out and the grass is green on the other side.